Hello everybody, Natalia here and I have this fun project today come to you and you know what? We are going to do this box together. It's a pencil case, but you know what? I said your kids can take it to school to the pen with the pencils. Forget about. <laughs> Let's use for ourselves. Look at this. We're gonna work today with sparkle gems. So of course I'm gonna work with this fancy fancy gem stylist. And look at this, you can place in here all tools you need. You can place your wax on this side. You can place even your little washi tape in here. Anything you wish for diamond painting. So I think this tool every diamond painter should have. Because now you're going to have your tools organized nice and clean. So I'm going to close the slit. It's click very tight. And I think I'm not going to even bother to put the gems into the separate bags because it's not many in here of them. So I'm just going to like cut and we're just going to work a little bit since I'm planning to finish the whole thing. I'm not going to even put the whole thing because I think we're going to have a lot left. And I want to show you those gems that I was talking about looks like a stars. They are so pretty. Let me find a light. Look how pretty they are. So I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna work with these gems. So I'm gonna peel. I'm gonna peel the sticky sheet probably from everything because we're gonna go kind of like all over. Or I'm just gonna keep a little bit at the time guys and we are gonna work together because I want to do a tutorial well for these big gems I'm gonna use probably tweezers and that's a number one on a pattern so I will try to seal this box with you and I already kind of have idea how I'm gonna do it because it looks like it's a nice clean edges that we can make a very very pretty looking there if you wanna you just close back and make sure it stays you press them a little bit harder so let's just place all number one all over of this box And if you hear some noises, guys, it's my computer running, it's loading video on my computer that I recorded today. And my computer acting up pretty kind of bad this day, so it's taking me forever to upload video. So I just recorded two videos today because my family not home. So I take advantage of time being alone and it's quiet. Peace and quiet, yes. So I record. I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish or not. Because they should be on a way home soon. They went to a Wonderland in Toronto. All those roller coasters and park to have fun. Okay. Make sure we're on camera. I really like these gems. I did not have this kind of stars before. They are really interesting. The foil cover on the top make them really sparkle. It's like a rainbow. So usually I start my Okay, I'm just going to peel this page out totally. Usually I start from smaller beads and finish a big one on the top. But today I decided to start from bigger gems just for in case I don't have a time to finish like right now in one sentence because I don't know what time my family going to be here. Then I have to pause video. So I want to start with the prettiest big 
diamonds and I think we place now all the one number unless I miss something um, no I think I did all and guys look at this already wow that's a lots of beads left usually you're not getting this much from Aliexpress if I'm tell you honestly look at that that's a lots of beads left usually it could be like you know three five because it's a big gems oh I missed one I missed one I missed one in here in the center let me get it there okay so now I think we're gonna go with number three which is gonna go from the center and go up okay so number three it's gonna let me cut them after after box so I don't stick because now I don't have a cover on my box and this is beautiful those teardrops kinda oh my god this one Look at that. That's that's a pretty gems. So I don't know how many I need in here. We're gonna place them on number three. So let's start from our little compartment here. There. I love it. So this is definitely gonna be for my tools, guys. For my fancy tool or those tools that I work all the time. So I wanna keep them clean and neat. And I have some fancy uh, tools that I've received with diamond paintings. So I will have them in this case, beautiful and clean so this is gonna be my box I hope we on camera yet I will link it up for you in the description box link to this product and there's the other one that I want to do with you for sure it's that clock and you guys not the clock sorry the night light LED light you guys ask me to do together with you it uh, would be my pleasure you better believe it I'm like a kid in a candy store where it's come to sparkle gems As much as I try in my video to be bright, I'm creating lots of shadow, guys, because it's a very, I call grumpy day outside, and it's just not enough sunlight, I guess, which, it, this looks bright, but it's just not, for video, not as bright as I would love to. So my, I may have to edit like a layer of bright, um, edit filter to my video to lighten up a little bit okay it's already looks oh looks amazing oh my god those gems are so pretty guys look at that that's beautiful okay let's do one more flowers one more flower right here I would love to bring you more clothes to my box, but if I do that, then I'm gonna be like off the camera because I keep moving a box. Different position. Because with the sp special gems, you kinda need to 
line up proper way okay okay I need two more and I think that's it Wow, guys, I'm telling you, if you decide to buy this 3D project from sasdeal.com, I'm gonna show you how many gems left from this one flower. It's just like, when you order it from them, you know you will get lots of gems left over, but I didn't think it's gonna be this many in a special gems. That's a lot of gems in here, honestly. That's a lot. That's really, really good. Uh, number four, another special, another special. But that's one pretty color. Ooh. Okay, I just hope they're gonna be enough for all colors, but I hope so. Let me try if it's going to be better. I'm just going to refill my drill pan a little bit with the wax. I'm just going to scoop a little bit more wax in here and see if if with this tool will be better to kind of... Okay, let's find a camera there. Okay, maybe with the pen a little bit easier. Wow. Oh my, that, that is so pretty. That is so pretty, guys. Yeah. It doesn't have extension in here for this green gems because it's like an end of the box. You see that? But if I have leftover beads, I might gonna just add a little bit glue and put more gems if they fit or not. So And my LED light, the glue up there spread all over through the whole image. In here, we have glue only on the symbols. Sometimes, like, you can't really shake them, so I can, like, tap it down on a table and they flip into the right side that I need. Hopefully we have enough of these gems because I don't think I have same kind just for in case if I run out I don't think I do have the same kind of gem so that's gonna be bad but I think we should be just fine they really generous actually on the beads Whatever they, which factory they work in, it's a good, generous company. They don't afraid to put extra drills, which I know that's why they do in business so good, because they don't have a complaints over, you know, not enough drills. I think I need a few more of these boxes for the Christmas presents. 
I really love it. Okay, we need a two more on the edges right in here and here okay how we do now in here oh those jewels my goodness guys this is so beautiful and once again we have gems left over now next one we're gonna do we have a teardrop in here number two This kind, I already have them before. I can't remember on which diamond painting though. Um, I, I remember this kind of beads already I worked before with. Okay, so number two, it's in here on the petals. Okay, let's just try a little bit, get more clothes. Maybe gonna be less shadow there. My tray doesn't have to be on a camera, but the image itself would be nice if you can see better. There. Let me put my lamp, guys, on the other side of the camera. Hold on. I hope I don't like hit the camera here. Maybe will be better because it looks like I'm making a shadow with my own hand. So let's see if this way gonna be better so we have a two in here and in each big petal right there okay yeah seems to be brighter right now i just put on a wrong position camera i thought it would be better but it's not so i think you can see better now Watch movie storybook. Once upon a time storybook movie. <gasps> Me and my little girl still watching the season first. I don't know how long this movie been on TV, or this is something new or old. But we just now find out about it, and we already like episode 17 probably on the uh, first of the episode but there's like a seven episodes oh my god the movie are so interesting all those characters from stories in one movie it's like it's so interesting to figure out who is who so let me know if some of you watch this story storybook call okay i think i think we're done with number two and now wow that's a very generous amount of beads guys left. That's a lots of gems left up there. See that? A lot. Okay, so uh, we're gonna go now with number six as it's go next one to our symbol. And that is this beautiful, gorgeous ruby red color this is so fast we will be done in no time in the real time with no stopping video okay we are not gonna stop video all right let's start from this little petal in here Okay, figure out the camera. All right. Oh, this color is so bright. It's going to brighten up the whole picture. I'm going to have a fancy... Schmancy 
case from my pencils, from my tools, diamond paint and tools. This will be so much fun to do project with kids because it's so fast. And kids like sparkles, just make sure if that's a little tiny kids, make sure you always stay with them so they don't put those beads in their mouth. But if you have already like a older kids in school and they know what they're doing, I think everybody would love to do this. My little girl, Catherine, well, I call her little girl, but she's not very little, she's 11, but I ask her permission if I can do um, uh, these two projects by myself or she want to do, she's like, go ahead mom, you can do it, it's okay, but she's excited about the LED light for her room. And I'm actually really interested to see how it's going to look like when it's lighting up with those lights. It's interesting how they, uh, you know, come out with so many different projects, right? It used to be just a canvas and that's it. Now pencils, wallets, keychains and so many different. Every week I look on a website, I always find something new. So you guys have to check it out more often because they always have something new and exciting. And I just like look forward to see what else they will have close to Christmas because that's kind of like, well, to Christmas you really have to shop like now. Um, we'll still have time. I think their shipping are not very long. But to be prepared now, lots of beautiful Christmas images up there as a diamond paint and canvases. Okay, here we're moving forward to our next flower. This is so fast project, but so much fun. I'm enjoying like a kid right now. So how many of you ordered already this pencil case? Yeah, let me in the comments. Let me know if you already ordered this one. My camera just started. I can't believe we already recording for 23 minutes. Time is flying. So obviously this video is going to be a little bit longer. If you don't mind, you can of course a little bit and go forward to see the, the end of the project but if you like to see the whole process of this fun drill with me then please stay I love you to stay with me so I have somebody to talk to ok 
Okay, I'm just gonna refill my drills a little bit in here on a tray. I don't even need to put them all on my tray because I know it's gonna be lots of left. And you can pick the best ones, but to be honest, they all look exact same one to one. Um, in this particular color, I do not see any like less muted color and more bright. They all look bright, so I'm just picking it one by one without even looking the quality because they all look good. Sometimes in a diamond painting, if canvas big, it could be. Um, um, some gems could be not as bright this one is looks really good though okay sorry if I went a little bit off camera okay six right in here couple actually three okay are we done already with this color let me just check quickly Okay, only here around wow yes I think we did so now I'm gonna change to number seven and once again as you can see lots of bits left here's the number six how much left a lot a lot so number let's go number seven and seven is like a breathtaking pink oh boy Am I happy right now to do with all this gorgeousness? Wow. One red sneak in here, but here it is again. The quality of the gems. Very pretty. So number seven, we're gonna start again from the smaller section of the box, right in here. Now it's all five left in here, and five guys number. It's a clear, the it's like a frost. So bright, beautiful gems. I cannot tell you enough how beautiful they are. Oh, I'm definitely. I like to order some more as a presents. I just want to first see how they're gonna work if I can seal them. So let's make sure go nowhere you know what I mean plus I don't know how it's gonna work because it's on a plastic Where I am, okay. There to here. Fill in. I'm enjoying so much with this special gems today. I think I forgot to talk. I was just forgot I even recorded the video, guys. <laughs> I guess I enjoy too much with this project. I really do. And it's just my mind right now going because I think what they're gonna do with it and what is the best way 
to try to seal so you would like it and maybe you would use it so if I ruin this box I'm gonna be sad but at least you're not gonna make my mistake so I will do it for you and hopefully it will work perfect so we can have a beautiful gift box Can you imagine to take this on the sun outside? Ooh. All neighbors across the street are going to be blind with it. Okay, a few more. Some in here. We have some right in here. So yes, I decided to make this video longer but without any, well because you guys asked me not to do like a fast video and just do in a reel because you like to enjoy watch, have those drills placed and listen to my rumbles. On Monday which is gonna be what is gonna be no it's not gonna be September oh, yeah September 30th which I don't know when this video go live but September 30th uh, I will start my fitness challenge boot camp three days a week we can go more than three if we wish but with the personal trainers and stuff like that so I'm looking forward. I'm really looking forward and I'm excited. Okay, number five, guys, last kind of gems. And this one, oh my god, this is like the most brightest gems I ever see, I think. I don't think I have this kind of gems yet. Hold on, let me strain them up a little bit. And of course the shadow will kind of ruin it, but wow, uh, this is just spark out of this world. I think it's the best so far gems that I see. I don't know. They look so clean and so bright. So let's start this corner. Make sure I'm on camera. I'm going to hold the box. And let's finish one section of it so we can see the whole colors, how they look together. I think you will like it. Of course, if you like gems, you will like it. But I think you wouldn't be watching a diamond painting if you wouldn't like sparkles. I think we'll like sparkles. That's why we addicted to this kind of craft. They are our one call corner is done. Now let's do this corner. My computer is acting up. The video that I'm exporting is like almost finished, but it's a hold and it's like it's not letting finish 100%. And you can probably hear the loud noises. How the computer box fighting. Just so slow these days. I don't know what's going on.
so I'm impressed if I will have same quality gems on the LED light I'm gonna be really happy so I'm just gonna do all the way around this side and then maybe turn box the other way and do the other side maybe this way will be better I think this video is gonna be way too long. I don't know if I should finish now by myself because obviously this is the same color beads left. Gems, it's frosty white or clear, not white, clear. Clear or white, how would you call it? Clear, I guess, because they are clear. Okay, I think that's what I'm gonna do because the video is gonna be way like an hour long. Um, I will finish and I will show you the finished box. All done guys, it's all done. And what I'm thinking right now, because I have in here, for example, this area in here, let me show you with the pen, that we have a two gems in here and two is open. So if I would want to add more of these gems on this part, I don't know if I will have, so I have here leftover two for this side, two from another side would be, um, and then I have only three left. Oh, if I would have one more extra, I would probably have enough to place in here and on each on each corner in here so but look how beautiful that is um, because I was thinking maybe I even will place just um, maybe just on the corners without doing this one I don't know what do you think if I would get this one and put some glue see how it's fit See how it's fit. It looks much better than just like an empty space in here, right? If I would add one more in here, but I will have to place, tack it over glue first. And then maybe I would add to the other corners. Let me grab another pen. This one beads is heavy. This gems is heavy, but first I thought it would be nice to have like in here or maybe instead of corners I will add in here on this side okay it's stuck a little bit my glue up there on this side and then one in here and one on this side like this and then I just need like I uh, just short for one bead guys hmm too bad I don't have one more maybe I have to look maybe I have something very very similar in color from a peacock lady or something else because I think that was kind of make it more full instead of this part being kind of exposed feels like it's not finished so yeah that would be nice let me know what you think about it and where is the other one bead already stuck in here because it doesn't have a glue okay but I think it looks beautiful so what I'm thinking I'm gonna do two parts of video guys because this video will be way too long if I will start sealing as well 
but that flower center oh my god I'm just totally blown away by the collection of this gems in here it's tied together so nicely um, I, I love it I love it so yes um, this is gonna be part number one and the part number two I will the other way part number two I will make uh, how I seal and some tips for you because the edges in here pretty nice and straight so maybe you know I will cover them so the if my whatever I'm gonna seal with not gonna drip down to the sides and seal the box right um, but anyway so I will show you that in my next video but for this video I mean all the gems guys left and I need to be careful with them because they are not closed now I will go and put them on a special containers with all my leftover beads oh you know what I have more gems left of this one maybe I, I will add instead of this I will add the center this gems to those empty spaces because I have more of them hmm that's idea I think I like the idea okay so we have in here absolutely every color guys left so I'm really pleased with this so if you like to order for somebody for Christmas right now before it's too late because I'm not sure how they ship um, fast to wherever your country are right so it depends on where you are so it could be longer could, could be faster so it better be you know sooner than later and I thank you for staying with me and being patient because I think this is absolutely gorgeous let me try to turn off light see if it's gonna be better or not if this is like a natural light of course it's dark oh can you imagine I'm just said there is no Sun in here now it's 622 and it's really dark okay guys thank you very much for staying with me and I will see you in part two of this video but it's gonna be posted probably day later because uh, the resin that they're gonna seal you have to like 48 hours or 24 at least to dry before we even move to show you so I'm gonna show you process little bit by little bit uh, in a mix between different um, videos that I will create for you okie dokie I will see you in my next video